I'm going to show you how you can create a custom glow in Storyline, like the ones that you see here. You may have applied a glow to a shape or an image or a button um, using the shape effects glow yourself in the past. Um, as you see here, there's different color glows and different sizes, and you can change the color of the glow that appears here by going to the design ribbon and changing your um, theme colors. But let's say you didn't want to do that, and let's say you wanted to create a glow that is bigger than the biggest one that's available in this menu. How could you do that? That is what I am going to show you here. So I'm just going to go to a new slide where I've just created a simple blue rectangle. I'm going to right-click on my rectangle and select Format Shape. Then I'm going to go to Shadow, and I'm going to select the Outer Offset Center Shadow. The default color for the shadow will be black, but here is where you can change it to any color that you want. So let's say for this example I'll make it um, this blue color here. And now there's a bunch of options available here. Uh, transparency size, blur, angle distance. Here's where you can edit the size and the look of the custom glow that you're creating. So let's say you go to size and we make it bigger like this. Transparency will affect the color and you can make it darker or lighter. And then blur will kind of <clears throat> soften the edges of the glow that you're creating like this. And so you can make it as big um, as you want, as small as you want, um, as dark or as light as you would like it to be. You can just play around with all the options here to really customize the glow to make it look any way that you want it to. And so that's how you can easily create a custom glow in Storyline using the Shadow Tool.